This is the big story presented by HerbChambers.com. Today, Filene's basement filed for bankruptcy protection. It's the third time in just over a decade, and this time it seems it's going to be Filene's basement's last. Uh, as part of the court filing today, they said that they're going to be liquidating all of the stores along with their corporate parent, Sims, uh, by January of 2012. It's been a really difficult environment for everyone the last few years, retail in particular. It's been somewhat of a bloodbath and Filene's Basement never had the size and the scope that other uh, retailers and competitors had like TJ Maxx and Marshalls. So they were always had um, fewer stores, fewer, less buying power and it was just really difficult for them to climb back. A lot of people said that taking Filene's Basement out of Downtown Cross and closing that store really did take the heart out of the operation. It was the highest performing store by far, it was the most visited of anyone, and it was really sort of the epicenter of the operation. And so a lot of people have claimed that since that was gone, there was no way that they could recover. And it closed because of a redevelopment project that actually has yet to take place. I'm Jen Abelson for the Boston Globe.